Emeryville, Calif. KGO Emeryville police say they were on the scene Sunday evening after about 300 juveniles broke into groups and were involved in multiple fights near the AMC Theater on Bay and Shellmound Streets. Catherine Borid from Fresno says she ran right into the group as they were trying to leave the area. There were just these throngs of kids, I want to say 300, 400 kids, Borid said. Things were fine, it was just a little strange, and then all of a sudden, they started running towards us. We thought there was like gunfire or a knife or something happened. And in what felt like a stampede of teenagers running her way, she says, both her and her son got knocked over. Someone pushed past me, and I hit the ground. He has a couple of skinned knees, she said. Emeryville police say, among the fights, one single gunshot was fired but didn't hit anyone. About an hour later, they say one juvenile was stabbed near Elm Street and taken to the Highland Hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. Captain Oliver Collins, a spokesman for the Emeryville Police Department, tells ABC 7 News that, out of the hundreds of teens involved, just one juvenile was arrested. My thing is just what were 400 kids doing? said witness Brenda Valladares. They said it was over 400 kids. What were they doing here unsupervised without their parents? And it's scary, because she sometimes wants to go to the movies, and I'm like, I don't think you're not at that age to go by yourself. Valladares says the Bay Street Mall incident spilled over into a nearby Target, when she witnessed teenagers pulling items off shelves, making a mess of the store and shoplifting in front of her family. People were getting mad and everybody was stealing everything. Everything was on the floor, said witness Annalise Garcia. Although police wouldn't confirm the connection to the Target incident, they did say there was a link-up posted to social media, which originally called the mass amount of teens to the Bay Street Mall. Just a very scary evening in Emeryville, Borod said. This, on National Cinema Day, where tickets at AMC theaters were being sold for just $4. Shortly after the incident, AMC put a message on their website, confirming this location has been temporarily closed.